hi, my name is uh, Shahrir. Uh, I'm a graduate from Faculty of Creative Multimedia, uh, batch 2001, batch 2001, and I graduated in 2007. Uh, my majoring is uh, interface design, uh, which is uh, the short form is ID. Uh, ID actually, uh, when I say to people is it's ID, sebenarnya is interface design. Uh, not 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 interior design. So most most of the people when we heard of ID, they thought it's interface design. But actually, it's interface. What we learn is uh, we learn about uh, interface to create some inter something something like on the handphone or gadgets, the interface thing where we can interact. Uh, that is all about interface design. So I learned that uh, during my alpha, beta, gamma, and delta years. I don't know the the campus uh, life now. I mean the current current in this current years. But for me, for us lah, during our 2001 when we enter MMU during they call it uh, foundation years, which is alpha. For us at that time, it's a big transition from uh, uh, orang cakap uh, di bawah uh, orang kata jagaan mak bapa, and then suddenly we are free, free. Then we uh, we our own life to go to class and then to decide whether we want to go to class or not. <laughs> so, uh, but but it's it's a fun year, you know, because when we uh, interact with new friends and lecturers and do assignments and follow all the rules yang kita kena ikut, it discipline us actually. Bila pikir balik lah, uh, macam it make us what us today. Eh? Uh, Sometimes bila kita rasa macam like I I me myself I manage my own company and then when we have our own macam off track ataupun orang kata malas day tu then we think back during our MMU life atau our university life how our lecturer guide us how our lecturer macam discipline us throw koyak and then kunci pintu everything they discipline us to be someone like someone us today uh, so MMU I think MMU life really teach me and my wife to be a good one a good person lah uh, a discipline person uh, someone that that yang sentiasa I think that our president is uh, that time is Prof Gau Jasmine uh, they they always cakap uh, always pandang jauh ke depan uh, so I still remember dia punya speech waktu kita graduate waktu tu always pandang jauh ke depan always uh, apa orang kata jinakkan diri in entrepreneurship uh, dia galakkan so uh, so so that that itulah yang jadikan kita macam ni I'm Faiza Ahmad Fazil but in social media my name is different <laughs> so people uh, know me as uh, Ishenta so you can google lah <laughs> if you want to so okay Ishenta it's all started with the MMU things ada apa dengan cinta essentially so the name people call me E my short name so during the MMU um, it's actually MMU it's not a I mean masa I teenage masa I um, sekolah rendah lah eh, sekolah um, dajah enam lagi I dah tahu University Telecom because um, masa time tu when I um, habis UPSR so the one of my teachers cakap uh, to masukkan I dalam asrama but I tak nak actually I memang seorang yang <laughs> rebel student so I yang rasa um, untuk pergi ke asrama mm, not suit for me I lebih prefer untuk stay at home lah okay and then I cakap dengan um, my teacher time tu uh, cikgu tak apalah you uh, cikgu kata okey kamu macam tu I apply ke UBS Siswa uh, University Telkom so I dapat tapi sebab I tak accept <laughs> so during the M master time SPM tu I tak 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 inilah tak manage lah untuk dapat the straight A's kan tapi I nampak my friends sebab I belajar accounting during my uh, secondary um, so I minat sangat art so the the uni that uh, that uh, macam ada ada something yang catch my eyes is MMU at that time because dekat Melaka kan because I'm orang Melaka I from Melaka so uh, graduate uh, graduated samalah dengan Cik Syarif 2007 okey so bila time dekat um, bila I dah tahu multimedia because one of my friends masa uh, during the kita nak tunggu result SPM so 
she was like macam uh, masuk satu uh, program MME program it was fun that was the creative multimedia at that time they they approach us the students kan uh, so during nak tunggu SPM new result so i macam eh fun ya i budak account so boring <laughs> so i was like macam okay i nak try multimedia university because i minat fashion tapi i tak ada that background of art so the best thing that i can pursue my dreams in art is in multimedia so that's why i apply for the multimedia course is creative multimedia and i dapat so uh, kita pun in the campus live i tak jumpa lagi encik syaril <laughs> so at that time terjumpa bila jumpa dah ni kena tanya dia ni soalan jumpa mas so we ada uh, fundamental art punya class so every time sebab uh, he's in uh, id interface design and i'm in digital media so memang different digital media is uh, lebih fokus on the interactive design which mean apa yang cik syari buat the uh, interface i manage to buat the interactive so masa time student life tu as a dah dah, dah dah partners kan kalau dia ada assignment ke dia tolong <laughs> ada assignment ke dia tolong complete kan uh, so during that time pun masa student um, i tak tak buang masa uh, especially during the cuti sem i will do the networking on the macam kita buat part time jobs like buat the graphics uh, the website i uh, get the money from there to sustain my my campus life punya ni because i bukan datang daripada well family lah kan kita saya sembilan adik beradik so i'm the youngest get a not only macam experience pergi mama lah, aja boleh pak ke get experience macam uh, i i masa join my uni i um ada dengan casting agency kan hmm. so that time i buat for shabas uh, for shabas corporate video so that uh, uh, production team tanya i you from mmu yes i'm from mmu oh you boleh buat logo <laughs> i dalam fikiran ah I tak pandai buat logo tapi kawan I pandai tapi because maybe because kita dah ada mindset kan I tak tahu lah mungkin bisnes sudah naturally dekat dalam jiwa ni ke kan so I macam oh boleh saya tahu <laughs> saya boleh I deal kan benda tu the 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 business tu I minta my friends uh, from FA final animation buat the interactive so I submit tapi through I <laughs> so that's how we do the networking That's how we 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 buat lucid lah dengan all the stud, uh, kita punya ex MMU. So um, uh, at that time uh, kita pun terjumpa and kita pun dah be a good partner during the MMU kita boleh buat assignment together and then sampailah dah habis MMU pun we started our business in photography. We decided to uh, ada Fuji Film business. So um, so dari situ um, sebelum berkahwin lagi we manage to become a partner lah. Uh, that's how we started with the photography. Bagus juga uh, ada Cik Mat yang telah hasil daripada uh, didikan Cik Mat our lecturer. We would like to thank him because because of his all this uh, knowledge kan we manage to build our own company until now. In terms of what uh, our our own goal after we graduate during that time macam during our uh, final years in my my final years in ID actually at that time I really don't have uh, I really can't see which which path I'm going to go but uh, uh, but uh, bila dah nak habis final year tu bila dah hujung-hujung tu uh, so I start to develop my own uh, orang kata minat in entrepreneurship so We started like 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 uh, when Shanta said we started our own small business, do some uh, uh, all those freelance job, graphic jobs, uh, ambil orang kata ambil upah buat kerja kerja grafik, design name card, was to buat for me like uh, island 3D, so we do some 3D jobs buat in, interior, so sometimes like people uh, I, I mean our own networking yang yang nak buat 3D jobs. I still remember in 2008 I think uh, someone asked us uh, asked me to do a boutique uh, that 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 so called client wanted to open boutique so she wants us to design 
uh, a, a boutique lah with 3D. So we do, and then uh, bila I I ask my friend to help me to do some all the rendering stuff and everything. Uh, and then that 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 is my first uh, 3D jobs lah. And then waktu tu pun kita nak charge pun macam tiga eh, ratus eh tak boleh eh lima ratus eh takut 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 nak charge ya eh. yeah lah first time kan student kan uh, baru nak graduate. So along the way we develop our our own besides our own technical skills we develop our own PR skill how to deal with people how to to negotiate how to uh, quote uh, give price quotation and, every, and everything. So uh, actually my advice is for students at the moment it's okay it's very very good to start with small small jobs it's it's it will give you experience something and sometimes it's not an about the job huh? it's not about the job itself sometimes when when uh, when when you see someone give you uh, can you design, design me a name card uh, for example so maybe you said mm, name card je kan no it's actually you will it will give you experience how to deal with people sometimes it will give you how to more work. networking because whatever things uh. that they say people around us okay uh, the i mean dia orang bagi arahan apa saja nah, arahan the, bentuk the arahan like name card, name cards kan uh, i pun pernah buat kerja masa first job hmm. my boss i graphic designer my boss asked me to cut the name card for how many pieces hmm. nak tak nak you have to so learn the small small things that, that the you, details I want uh. today today uh, this get it, done. get it done so we we have no excuse time to get ikut je kan yeah, okay. yeah of course hmm. that, that, that's what hmm. I'm, I'm going to say lah uh, as a student I mean or you are about to graduate don't kita tak boleh memilih lah uh, don't very choosy uh, lah don't very choosy we hmm. we me uh, we ourselves we learn very low very basic. basic so i mean every single thing kita buat satu 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 even uh, two years three years after we graduate we open our own studio uh, photography studio plus uh, printing lah i mean we offer printing untuk orang orang kata orang Melayu cakap cuci gambar hmm. uh, cuci gambar 4r 5r 6r so uh, I at that time I don't have any mentor. Uh, all I all I have is my knowledge during my university years. We learn photography, we learn to develop the film and then print the film. So I use that 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 knowledge and then put inside my uh, new venture business at that time, which is the the, the, the Photoshop, and then. Kita jalankan je business tu, yeah. and then along the way, uh, we we learn, 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 learn. Then of course lah, if you want to go into entrepreneurship, you must have the courage to uh, to fall. Uh, <laughs> to fall, kita to crawl. Kita takkan cuci <laughs> dekat atas. That that yeah. that is the thing that we orang kata hantuk pada dinding lah. We we learn so that the next time or in the future we don't repeat the same mistake again. Uh, itu itu yang orang kata pengalaman yang berharga lah. And I think for students yang masih belajar sekarang benda tu yang you kena kena belajar. I mean benda tu yang paling penting lah if you want to go into entrepreneurship. Learn to fall and then bangun balik, fall, bangun balik, fall, bangun balik. And then every time you bangun balik you will be a better 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 person. Insya-Allah. And then uh, since I pula dalam interactive design, so apa yang Encik Syarir dan kami lalui along the way we nak start from scratch our business. Untuk dia, he's very reserved. Uh, maksudnya dia tak tunjuk behind the scene. I pula, for me to make the networking, I always on phone. I always on macam I akan share what whatever I did um, during the during the process i will share walaupun orang cakap kenapa nak kena share kenapa nak kena tahu tahu kadang-kadang all details like macam we are packing the the the, the packing the product from a, a setup kan kadang-kadang orang rasa malu some people they want to um, portray to the world that uh, our business is okay our business is already success 
Ah, uh, it's actually for me. I in digital media. This is what I I I share lah. My tips eh. I always share whatever I did during my process uh, to the audience. Last time, kita tak ada Instagram. All the things that we need to have is blogspot, photo pages, yang tak interactive langsung. Takkan you nak buat website, it cost us a lot dalam student kan? So, apa yang kita perlu buat ialah um, whatever yang you ada, you letak dalam blog ataupun uh, dulu kita blog kan, blogspot. Uh, so since I know I apa yang dia buat, I ambil gambar dia, I post kan, we post inside the blog and then that's why people appreciate whatever things that you've done, uh, that the brand, the start, that's how you brand, brand you will, people will talk about your brand lah. If, if, if some students say, oh, oh I'm very shy to talk to people, I'm very shy to, to introduce our product to people to like macam beli, it's actually <laughs> kami berdua pun, it takes Five years, five years juga. Ada kedai, ada kedai gambar, all the celebrities datang. Tapi mulut kunci, buat kerja je. Sebab kita memang behind the scene punya, kan? Keep people like macam camera and ambil gambar, record, I pun hehe, senyum senyum, kan? Tapi the networking ada, but kita tak push. Never mind, you will learn the process. Uh, go, go after a while, go find something, uh, something ada or seminar to develop your PR skill uh, networking not only you talk to people yang um, sama level uh, and then you talk with people yang lebih mature uh, okay. <laughs> from the photography punya business Encik Syari always uh, the CEO of the company tarik dia the CEO from the creative <laughs> creative light box to join me we use our knowledge in creative multimedia, which is uh, one of the the things that we still uh, uh, implement until now is the photography lah. Kita still masih shoot lagi sendiri. We do our own shoot. I always have ideas, a lot of ideas. Tapi I selalu dapat ideas tu dalam kereta. So my meeting kan kadang uh, bukan di office ya, di dalam kereta sambil dia drive, sambil dia hmm, okay.